Hi, this is Mike Waters, coming to you live and in color down in San Diego. And I just wanted to talk a little bit about global warming and climate change. For those of you who still don't believe, I just have two words for you. This is uh, global warming made simple, ice age. So, and what I'm talking about here is since the end of the last ice age, about 15,000 years ago, the planet has been warming up all by itself. It's an amazing thing. So yeah, human beings haven't had too much to do with it until maybe the 1880s after the Industrial Revolution. And yeah, we're pumping a lot of pollution into the air and we're helping it warm up. But you gotta ask yourself, since the end of the Ice Age, did you ever think it was gonna stop warming up? The answer is maybe. Chances are it's probably not. It's gonna get hotter, it's gonna get warmer climate changes with the temperature of the planet and so these things are are going to keep going so no doubt in my mind so and there's there's a lot of historical evidence too now as a history major got a degree in history and english taught school for a while history and english kind of cool so a lot of people who skip those classes probably don't don't get it yet but maybe you will you know, and I'll go, you know, this is just an introductory. This is Global Warming 101, so I'm going to go to 301 in my next uh, broadcast here from my YouTube channel. Uh, anyway, just keep those things in mind. There's a couple of different reasons for global warming other than what the scientists or the current scientists are talking about. And uh, there is, there are some solutions. You know, so yeah, nobody's really talking about any kind of a solution. And uh, you know, I got three different ideas that might be able to uh, curb global warming and actually reverse it. So if you want to stay tuned, I'll have a little more in-depth uh, report or broadcast for you uh, in the coming weeks. This is Mike Waters, over and out. Oh wait, you know, it is San Diego. It's like a week before Christmas and it's about 80 degrees. Can't get much better than that, huh? Global warming does have its perks. Bye.